Hello, my fellow. Hello, my fellow mermaids, and thank you for tuning in. Food on my teeth? I don't think so. What I have on the menu for you guys is my favorite. Yes, I said favorite Lululemon pants of all time. Not leggings. No, they're technically joggers. They're the ready to Rulu joggers by Lululemon, and they are the best thing ever. Literally the greatest. In my opinion, not everyone agrees with me, but I thought I've had these for well over a year now. They hurt my wallet like God. Not cheap, warning. I do not regret it at all. I didn't do this review earlier because they weren't selling them over spring and summer. We'll get to that why. But they're back and I've had a lot of questions about them. So let's review them first. The price. So this is Canadian, so it's gonna be I don't know where else because it's a Canadian company, so I don't know if it's cheaper here than other places, but our dollar sucks compared to America, so I don't know. But that's what it is in Canada. Now, they come in four colors currently. The gray, which I own, and those ones I've had for over a year now. They come in black. They come in a heathered black cherry. They also come in a heathered black and white, which actually I was at the mall and I decided to just go try them on. So sorry it's with like my iPhone footage, but I'll overplay it here. You can see that coloring. I felt the material was a bit different on these than the others, but maybe that's just inside my mind that these felt a little thinner. If you hear something in the background, it's because I live on the top floor and it's super windy and so it sounds like my house is a little blow down, so. For the material, it's called Rulu. So if you don't know what Rulu is, is it's Lululemon's like cliche material, like the tried and true longest called Luan. So Rulu is running Luan. So it is Luan specifically designed for running, specifically in the fall and winter months. So it's a thicker type of Luan. It's thicker, soft, so it's nice against your skin and it glides so it's supposed to not have as much pilling because of course running. Your thighs gonna be like this. The reason they didn't have it in spring and summer is not because it's discontinued, it's just Rulu material that it's made of is just not for spring and summer because it's just simply too hot. But now that fall's here and winter's here, it is my favorite material. It's warm. I always, whenever I go to Trevor's football games, I always wear them and I find them keep me really toasty. I wear them for walks. I know they're for running, but I just find it weird to run with joggers which I know is funny I just always think tights like the material but that's just a personal preference you could totally run in these they're super stretchy and flexible and then they slide and they feel so good just for me I tend to use them for more of a casual pants because they're my dressy sweatpants so when I want to wear sweatpants but I don't want to be a slob I wear these and you can actually dress them up if you guys want I was thinking I can do a jogger styling video comment down below and I'd be more than happy to just do a video where I show you how you can style joggers you know whether it be just more athleisure whether it be for working out or how you can dress them up like I've worn joggers to the bar if you dress it right depending on the kind of joggers so if you want that comment down below Right to you. It's a medium rise and so it just below your belly button on me. I find because they're a bit big here I can kind of pull them and up make them a bit of a high rise but they're not like a super high rise just a comfortable and I found the waistband is really nice. I've never had to pull them up when I'm running or walking or just sitting around. Like I find they just sit there nicely. They do have the drawstring. I'll play you song. I don't know if you can actually hear that, but yeah, just super stretchy. Just it's like a good quality waistband or like a yeah drawstring. That's the thing. For someone who has a bit bigger thighs or butt and smaller waist, uh, the nice thing about the drawstring is you can tie it up, so that's a plus. As for a little extra detail, they do have reflective. Uh, detail on the back of the pants so if you do do these for running or walking if you're in the dark cars won't hit you so bonus because that's not a good way to end a let's talk about the common pros and the common cons before i say my full review on them now they have a four out of five rating on lululemon which is actually pretty good because it's out of 176 people voted and keep in mind with reviews typically people only go and review stuff that turns out bad that many products there's going to be faulty things in manufacturers so that take that into account but also know that some people do have bad experiences and for all you know you could be one of them as well but that's just always the chance I'm just 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 a disclaimer common pros a lot of the titles were best pants ever best material at Lululemon don't want to wear anything else not fake news I totally agree they got comfort 
Yeah, super soft. The material, they actually, if you could look on Lululemon's website, and I agree, they call it buttery soft. I would be like, ah, this is all I ever want to wear at all moments in my life. They don't fall down, but we'll get to that. The very flattering waistband, which I know on myself, I find very flattering. They're true to size. I always wear a size four in Lululemon typically. Like that's my go-to and I wore these in size four. I tried on the Heather white and black ones. Four fit the exact same. So I would say there was one complaint of a girl who said they wished to size down. So keep in mind with these, they're not supposed to be baggy. They're supposed to be slimming. Like see how the fit is? It's, it's just not tight, it's like a tight, but you don't want them baggy like a sweatpants. You just want a very slim fit. So if you find them, they're baggy on you, that just means that you need to size down. So wear your true to size, but if you want them tighter, size down, you could get them baggy, but they're gonna fall down in your waistband, in my opinion. Like if I drive six the entire time, I'm like, <laughs> it's real attractive. Some people call this their favorite Lululemon material, others agree and call them their dressy sweatpants. We are classy broads. And best weekend pants because they totally are. They're just casual. You can just throw them on. You can dress them up. They're great for shopping, walking around, exploring, going to brunch. These are my favorite brunch pants because they're loose around the gut. So when I have too many pancakes and mimosas, nobody can tell about my soul. <laughs> and they're super warm, which I agree. But now we must talk about the cons because there's cons. There was quite a few complaints about pilling and I have two opinions on this. You don't know these people's lifestyle. You don't know if they're running around on the ground, if they like were doing sometimes any kind of material, if you're rubbing against mats and stuff, it's good to pill. There was a few of those. I've had these year and a half and I wear them at least once a week. I wear them multiple times a week. If anything, I've washed them a ton and there is no pilling for me. So. You don't know, and these people do claim a lot of times that they wash it properly, so it, I, I don't have an answer. Like I said, I don't work for Lululemon. It's just, this is just my experience. Everyone's different. The one common one I did get, and I don't want this to come off in a bad way, inner thighs was there was a lot of people saying, not a lot, but there's a few people are saying pilling. Just understand with joggers, and this is why I'm kind of odd that you jog in joggers, I know, is that it's just extra material. With tights, it's right against your skin, so it's just less friction, but when there's a bunch of extra material between your thighs, I think it's just more friction is gonna happen, so it is more likely to pill. Now for myself, uh, my thighs do not touch when I run, so I don't know if that's my body type or if that's just my pants experience, so I can't say, but yeah, there's there's absolutely no pilling whatsoever. And once again, it just really depends. So that's why I go back to make sure it's a slim fit, not a baggy fit, because I think that's one way to make sure to reduce the inner thigh. And it's okay for thighs touch because then you are that much closer to being a mermaid. And that is the ultimate goal. So girl, you did it. Two other ones about the fit that there was complaints. Uh, one individual said that the waistband cut into them and that very, and kind of curled, and that could just be wrong sizing, or it could just be faulty waistband or sign in there, or how they washed it. I just find it's very flattering on myself, and a lot of other people really love the waistband, but there was that one complaint. And then some people did complain about it falling down, but that could be the cliche, you just got a big butt and big thighs and little waist, so you also made it, so you just gotta use the draw band. But that, just be conscious. Lululemon's body type tends to be a bit more stickly, so if you've made goals and you've got the booty of the gods, sometimes that's the nice thing, this just has to draw strength, so keep that. Well, we're mad that there wasn't enough color choices because there's only four right now. And let's be real, once you try these on, you want them in every color so you can wear them every day of your life. Some people did complain about loss of size retention. I have not personally noticed that. Anything you wear is gonna stretch a little, especially depending how you dry it. It can stretch as well if you really let it, like if you let something that's soaking wet just hang there, it's gonna pull on it when it's wet and that can cause stretching. Also, if you do, if we go back to the other person's name comment, if you wear something that's too tight, it's gonna just pull on it past where it naturally wants to sit and so that will cause size retention. So that's just why I say get your, oh, I just, just got my hair down so I got those weird bumps in my extensions are really <laughs> In this. <laughs> so that can cause some size changes as well if you don't get the right size. So I just say get true to size. Overall, I think you guys got my just. These are my favorite pants ever. I wear them for comfort. I wear them 
for when I want to feel comfy and I'm bloated but I still want to look cute. I've dressed these up. If done properly, you can like really dress these up with a crop top and even heels. Probably wouldn't do that as much, but you could. I've definitely went out going shopping, done really cute crop tops with this around the waist, working out, I've even done. Wouldn't use this for spin, no bikes, because the extra material can get caught in the spokes. So I would say a big no-no to that. But running, walking, low intensity activities, fashion, super comfy, super flattering. Uh, they come with the pockets that they put the material in. and. Unfortunately, if you put too much stuff in the pockets, they ride down a little. They got a little extra reflective material. The, the issue is the price, and actually, I've wanted these for years. They have such good reviews, and I love them, but I didn't want to spend $120 on sweatpants. I get it. And then one day, I had a treat yourself day, because girls, sometimes you gotta treat yourself if it's gonna be worth it. And every single time I put these on, I'm like, yes, I am so glad I paid for this, and that's that mentality you have to have with it and you have to wear them at least 120 times. If you're gonna wear them 120 times, worth it. If it's a once or twice a month wear max, don't do it. But for me, this is these have been worn 120 times. <laughs> Let me tell you. <laughs> Hope you guys like this video. If you have bought the Ready to Rulu pads from Lululemon, comment down below. Let us know your thoughts. Like I said, we all have different body types, different activities, different experiences. So the more conversation we have down the bottom, the more we can find out about it. And if you have any specific questions about the Ready to Rulu pants, like I said, I'm not sponsored by Lululemon. I don't work for Lululemon. I'm just addicted to Lululemon. But I'm happy to help you guys out with any questions you have from my experience and my knowledge. So comment down below any questions and I'll make sure to answer them. Last, before I go, would you guys like me to go do a video and try on all the joggers at Lululemon? I can do that and just show the different fit of all of them because they have a bunch, of, a bunch of joggers in right now that seems to be kind of the theme for end of October, beginning of November. So you can go try them all on and compare them, let you know. If you guys want that, throw this a like and comment down below. Thank you for tuning in. Like always, my fellow mermaids, I hope you have a fabulous day. Thank you for tuning in. I love you so much. Sorry about all the background noise because my apartment's gonna blow over. <laughs>